Anan, babo ka balen kung sa kay Pu. My name is Louis, and welcome to Wern Pampanga. It's a rainy afternoon, but that doesn't stop us in discovering great places for you to check out, guys. Nandito ako yung sa Angeles City, particularly Busan Pampanga Station. This is the newest craze dito po sa Angeles City, and you gotta check this out, guys. It's an al fresco. If you're a millennial, for sure you're gonna enjoy this place. So if you want to know more about this, samahan niyo po ako. Let's go. place so you have two large tent it's an alfresco style we have two train cabin do niluluto yung mga pagkain natin oh observation ko dito a lot of the customers coming in here around 70 percent are millennials of course food lovers at the same time yung mga fan ng mga korean pop culture siguradong mag enjoy sila dito Surprisingly, you know, usually for a food business or in any, you know, kapag Monday, medyo lean day yan. Pero surprisingly, daming tao pa rin pumupunta dito. Super hook ang mga kapampangan sa Korean pop culture. Sa kapampangan naman, natural lang yung love natin sa pagkain. Kaya kahit anong pagkain yan, sigurado, explore natin. Nga pala, once again, thank you so much for being with us in this video. Sabi ko nga dun sa introduction natin, kahit na maulan ang afternoon natin, it's not gonna stop us in exploring places that you should go dito po sa Pampanga. So on our table, we have a lot of menu. Yung mga sinerv nila para sa atin dito. Let me give a rundown one by one first before natin tikman, okay? So meron tayo dito, it's a mixed samgyeopsal. So this is a 200 peso dish. So meron siyang grilled chicken, beef belly, pork belly, meron siyang kimchi, stir-fried fish cakes, bean sprouts, lettuce, and rice. Take note guys, nga pala. So this is not your typical, you know, unlimited samgyeopsalan or unlimited Korean food house. As soon as you come here, and so entrance pa lang natin guys, kukunin na yung order. You're gonna pick your most comfortable seat and then doon nila is serve once yung food natin is ready. Moving on, meron tayong bulgogi, meron din tayong vegetable bibimbap. Now, take note guys, ha, this is a vegetable, pure vegetable bibimbap. It's up to you if you want to, kumbaga, mag-add on tayo ng yung mga meat natin. So, beef, chicken, pork, add na lang natin yun when we order. So, meron tayong tukboki. And this one, this is, of course, it's uh, rice-based, no? Pero first time kung makikita ng ganitong serving, they call it jumyokbap. Isa pa sa mga dinadayan nila dito is yung mga, mga soup nila. So, this is odentang, meron din tayong ramyun and this is the kimchi rice ayan guys so inside it meron tayong kimchi egg and tuna what in fairness ang sarap nung kimchi that got me interested as well so tingnan natin yung kimchi nila a little bit of history um si busan pampanga station started or soft opened last june 10 ayan so it's a new business dito po sa angeles city but Again, um, very surprisingly, dinadayo po siya. Ito yung tukboki with cheese. So, available yung tukboki. If you want to add cheese yan, available yan. Anyway, when you come here and do the order dun sa, ano, as soon as you come in, kumbaga, tanong na natin kung ano yung pwede natin customize sa mga pagkain. Kudos sa mga nagluluto natin, sa mga chef natin. Very, very Korean. Okay, next I want to taste. Kahit na pinagpapawisan ako, guys. I mean, it's, it's rainy afternoon. You're, you're eating Korean food. What a pleasure, di ba? And then, kain ka pa ng, ano, ng uh, ramyun nila. Hmm. Before ko uh, tingman to, I gotta, you know, shout out the small owners ng uh, Busan Pampanga Station. They're really young entrepreneurs, no, guys? Sir Richard and Sir Marwin. So, kudos to you guys for coming up this kind of concept. When you go to a Korean restaurant, mga dishes na I would really want to taste is yung kanilang ramyun, kimchi rice, and of course, yung kanilang samgyeopsal. So again guys, this meal right here, it's a mixed samgyeopsal. Meron na tayong chicken, pork belly, beef belly, rice, some side dishes. It's only 200 pesos. Ah, 
coming in here, pinaka landmark natin is from the Santo Domingo Rotonda. Yan, pasok tayo dun sa kanto in between ng Sacred Heart Hospital at saka ng Jollibee. Yung unang left, pasok lang po tayo dun sa kanto na dun and then makikita nyo na to. If you like this video or if you like the food you saw in this video, if this was really helpful to you guys, I mean exploring places dito po sa Pamanga, please give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends. This is another option for you to check out. Very trendy, very pop culture sa mga Korean fanatics. This is the place to be. And for those who are, you know, just looking for a place to chill, good food, this is another option for you to check out. So once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. We're in Pampanga. Until our next discovery, guys. Peace out.